Do girls like dick pics? Oh God, no. <laughs> no? I don't. Hey, you. <laughs> Sorry, okay, I'm ready. Hey, you guys, welcome back to our channel. It's hashtag Roxley, and we are back with another video. So, today, you guys, my turn mm. to ask Roxy Ooh. the questions guys want to ask women, but might not really feel comfortable. Now, I don't really care for comfort whatsoever, so I'm just gonna go right into it. How many guys have you slept with? First of all, <laughs> you were supposed to ask 10 of those. All right. 13. <laughs> Number one, do women like abs or arms on a guy more? I like arms. I feel like it just depends on the woman. Me, Thank personally, God. I like arms. I don't really care for abs. I mean, they, they're nice and all, but I like a belly. Like, I want something to hold on to at night. You know what I'm saying? I Why like you just saw. tell everyone how much of a belly I have? I love it. I love, I love it. I love it so much. And I think that you should be very grateful that I love it because I think it's so sexy. And... On a side note to all men yeah, who I feel are like watching you have this, abs, though. If a woman starts cooking for you, that means she doesn't <laughs> want anything but you to be fat. But you don't even have abs, so why would you think, would you want me to be like, oh my, you know what would be worse if I was like, oh my god, I just love abs. And you don't have, no, no, sincerely, I, I prefer arms. Even I if you love like abs, a belly. you're not getting rid of me. Like, <laughs> I love a belly, so yeah, that's where we're at. That and I've always seen the meme that says, guys don't get six packs to date just one girl. Ooh, okay, okay. I. At least that's what I <laughs> All right, question number two. Question number two, and I've, I've always been curious about this myself. How often do women masturbate? Ooh, tell them my eyes. business. Big. Tell them my business, my business. Just no. answer the question. Um, not often. I don't really, I can't even remember the last time I actually because your husband satisfies you Maybe so like, much. yeah, like. Good answer. <laughs> when you were single, okay. how often would you masturbate in a week? Mm, once a month, I don't know. I don't know if I would do it every week though. All right, I'm not really, <laughs> I'm, I'm not agreeing with this. I need women to actually comment for this. How many times do you double Ooh. click the mouse? Woo. If you're comfortable. Ooh, wait. Okay. All right. Question number three. Do girls find it attractive if a guy claims to have a lot of options? No, that's not attractive. Not to me, at least. I can see the psychological aspect of it. Like, okay, he has a lot of women, so I'm more interested. I want to be that one that he picks. I want to be the one that makes a difference, you know, make it a little bit different. Um, but me personally, I wouldn't want to know something like that. Like I feel like I'm, I'm actually the opposite. So if I know that, then I really don't want you and you're not attractive to me at that point. So that's just me. Needless to say, I never said I had a lot of options. Question number four. Question number four. <laughs> do, I do I pursue a girl who's canceled on me twice? And I, I guess it's really asking you saying no. Is that playing hard to get? Mm. So to me, if a girl is going to cancel on a date two times, I mean, she's just really not interested. Um, because if I was super excited to go on a date with you and to actually meet you, um, I would actually plan a date that actually works and make sure that nothing gets in the way, you know, that day. Especially if I really am anxious to meet you and go on a date with you, so. Okay. Yeah. Question number five. Do girls like dick pics? Oh God, no. <laughs> no? I don't like, n not like in the beginning. I'm not saying I don't like your dick <laughs> Mom, it's just so hard to get it into frame. I mean, like. I'm just saying, uh -huh. I, uh -huh. okay, they say dick pics. Uh -huh. 
if you kind of, from the jump, from the first day you sending dick pics, like that's not attractive. What about day number two? That's not attractive. What if it's a really nice looking dick? That's not, I don't care about all that. You know like, what if I like perm the hair and everything? I, you know, <laughs> I think that dick pics are so overrated. Like, at, it's 2020. If you're still sending dick pics, like, I don't know. I don't like it. I haven't I sent like one in 2020. Well, I'm just saying, like, if we're at that point in our like, relationship where we like to send each other pictures sometimes sporadically just to kind of, like, spice up some stuff. Don't ever send me a dick pic. Okay, that's not what I'm saying. I'm saying... Hey, <laughs> I'm just... I'm saying for us, like, when we send each other, you know, like, if you're at work sometimes, I might send him something. Or you know what I'm saying? Like that's okay, but not to constantly like. Or the first time y'all are dating, y'all be sending dick pics and stuff. That's I'm not attractive. I'm sending you a dick pic every hour tomorrow. Mm -mm. <laughs> All right, question number six: Is it okay to wake you up in the middle of the night for a quick uh, sexy time? Romp in the hay. Hey, it just depends on how your girl is feeling. You know what I'm saying? So the answer is no. <laughs> It's okay, yeah. If you want it, I mean, if you if you get me in that position that I like, you just got <laughs> really excited. I, I'm gonna ruin this whole thing for you. If I'm waking up in the middle of the night, some issues going on. Yeah, it's not obviously, like, oh, hey, he doesn't I, wake up in the middle of the night. For I don't that. wake up for shit. Sleep is life to him. Yes. Sleep is life. You yes. know what I'm saying? He will not wake up for nothing. No, that's why I have like seven alarms in the morning. Yeah. All right, question number seven. Does a wedding ring on a guy stop you from flirting? Yes, what do you mean, what do you mean? I don't know, like there, there are some thirsty women out there. Oh no, that's the one I tried, no. Mm -mm. Okay. I wouldn't flirt. <laughs> you, you better not be flirting with anybody. Okay, either. absolutely. Question number eight. Should I tell a girl I'm a virgin or just wing it? Like if you are actually a virgin? Is that what that, that's saying, right? For guys who I, are virgins? I don't virgins? think I would have a question whether or not to tell you I'm a virgin if I'm not a virgin. Gotcha. Um, okay, so for guys who are a virgin, and if you're wondering, um, you know, if you wanted to, I don't know, that's weird. It just depends on where you're at in a relationship with someone. If you guys are that comfortable to have those type of conversations. Well, let's say yes. you're about to have sex with this person. You should have had that conversation before, but if you're about to have sex, then don't mention it at all. I think it's just going to make things really, really, really weird. Just go with the flow and I'll see Fucking wing it. <laughs> wing and then admit after the crying after, part of it. Yeah, like, when she's like, oh my god, it's so awesome. Oh my god, really? That was my real life? They ain't telling you that. Yeah, so. <laughs> Question number nine. What is the most sexually excitable spot on your body? Um, Mamma Mia. What's a Mia? I don't know, for me, what's get, what gets me going is... Yeah, what, what gets you going? I don't like kisses on the neck. I mean, I, I like it, it just depends. I prefer when, I just like to be kissed. I like to yeah. be, I like when a man's hands, like your hands go around my head and just like, okay, first of all, what are you doing? I'm trying to get you excited. This, this is not exciting me. <laughs> No, it's fine. You're I like I like when a man, you know what I'm saying? Like when you, you know, put your hand on. Like right there. Ah! Right, ah! right there. Oh no! That's that not turning me on. You know what I mean? You know how to do it. So that's just what turns me on. I like I like to be kissed. Your girl likes to kiss. So. Question number ten, and my final question. I made sure to make it a good Ooh, one. Okay. How do I politely ask? For a blowjob. You just don't. That has to be the <laughs> That has to be the most inappropriate thing I feel you can ask. Like that would make me not want to do it. Me me I wanna do it on my own terms when I feel like doing it. Or if you know we So the real answer is wait until your birthday. No. Well Bae, I, I have a task for Okay, um, don't ask me because if you ask me, I don't want to do it. Okay. I don't know why, it just turns me off. It just really turns me off to hear those words. All right, if it would make you not want to do it, in that case, I don't want to blow job. 
Oh, God. Double negative, baby. Yeah. He's so weird. I don't know. Ladies, let me know what you think. Like, I just, me personally, I just don't like to be asked that. Let me do it on my own. Let me feel, you know what I'm saying? Like, I want to please you and do some frisky stuff to you. You know, 69 and stuff. But I'm just saying. Yeah. I'm just saying. <laughs> Yeah, all right guys <laughs> that is all that we have for you guys stop messing up my hair <laughs> what stop messing up my hair that's funny i didn't say anything that's funny nope. you messing up my hair mm -hmm. that's real funny huh mm -hmm. okay um all right guys that is all that we have for you guys today we really hope you guys enjoyed it, that video. Um, I know we did a whole big bunch of and oats. But yeah, um, thank you guys so much for watching. Hashtag Fox Lee. See you guys in the next video. Bye. No, he didn't. No, he did not just mess up my hair. <laughs>